weather this morning. It's not a bad start by any means. It's a little bit warmer than where we've been for the past couple of mornings, but still cool enough that you're going to want a jacket or a sweater as you're heading on out. We're at 49 degrees here in Lawrence. Live Guardian radar at this time locally. We are dry. We have some clouds heading our way. They haven't moved in quite yet, but they're out ahead of this batch of storms that's now moving through north central Illinois. A little bit stronger earlier this morning where we had a couple of severe thunderstorm warnings. This is weakening and it will continue to do so as it is heading our way, but there is a very small chance that we could see a couple of isolated light showers or maybe just a few sprinkles out of this. I'm not expecting big impacts from that system by any means, really just some cloud cover that we're going to see mixed in with that sunshine today and then noon and beyond that chance for an isolated sprinkle or an isolated light shower that will favor our northwestern counties. But the problem with that is also going to be the fact that our air mass is still pretty dry. These dew point temperatures in the 40s, low 50s means as it's weakening already and then it's uh, coming overhead. A lot of that is going to be evaporating too, so likely most of that doesn't reach the ground, but still wouldn't rule out a couple of raindrops as you're heading on out into the afternoon hours. We're at 57 degrees right now in Indy, lower 50s outlying, even some upper 40s too, so cool enough again that you might want to start the day with a sweater, but you won't need it this afternoon. By the lunch hour, we're in the mid 70s. By the late afternoon, we're we're nearing 80. I think most stay just shy of it, but a few locations certainly could hit that 80 degree mark on the thermometer. Friday night football plans. We are looking fantastic. Temperatures in the mid 60s by 10 o'clock. This is going to be a much better evening than what we had last Friday where we had those strong damaging winds moving in and then something else pretty cool going on. We have the opportunity to possibly see an aurora here even as far south as Indiana. Remember we had that earlier in the year. Well, we've had a couple of large solar flares this week and some coronal mass ejections that are heading our way. So tonight, late tonight into early Saturday morning and say between about 11 and 2 o'clock and then again Saturday night into early Sunday, we will have that potential to see the northern lights. Go ahead and take a look. Uh, getting away from the city lights is going to be your best bet, but something really neat and a rare opportunity here. Future cast going through the weekend. Lots of sunshine on Saturday. We have a cold front passing today and then we'll have a cold front passing on Sunday. Looks to come in dry other than a few clouds and some gustier winds on Sunday. Things are looking fantastic over the next few days. 79 for a high today, that isolated slight shower chance. 77 in sunshine tomorrow and 82 with windier conditions on Sunday, but still plenty of sunshine. And then that cold front ushers in a cooler pattern as we go through next week. Monday on through the end of next week, we're looking at highs, upper 60s, lower 70s, but still keeping with that sunshine. Melissa.